but perhaps what the game will be best remembered for is that unbelievable catch by Adam Dale, which was even more miraculous when you consider Dale is a self-confessed liability in the field. Really, I think if uh, Ian Healy doesn't gamble, he's going to go down. He might go down gambling anyhow. In the air, there's a man out there. He's coming around. He's going to get close to it. Oh, what a ripper. That could turn the whole game. Adam Dale, he's got three wickets with the ball. That's one of the best catches you will ever see. Well, he, uh, he covered the ground pretty well running, but even that didn't get him close enough, and he had to make the uh, dive at the end. And he's getting a standing ovation from this crowd for a catch. And he deserves it because that was a brilliant effort, and that's now given uh, Queensland an outside chance. Having got uh, Phil Emery out, Emery, I think, wanted to go a little straighter. I think he was hoping to go straight back over the bowler's head. And look at the dive here. Oh, he's at full stretch. What a catch. And, it, and to hang on to it as well is a brilliant performance. Eight for 219. And the judgment there, he threw himself. He's flat out. And then he balanced and he took it. He knows he's taking the catch that keeps the balls in this match. The first time that Emery's gone in the air and Dale doesn't let his bowler down and are they a happy one? This is what one day cricket's all about, the skills of the players. He's bowled well, he's got three for 22. Here he comes around and takes a great catch. That's a classic. Yes, I think uh, the sight of mid-off up inside the circle convinced uh, Phil Emery that he could hit one over the top, but he just got it a bit to the onside. And the reaction there from uh, Dale, Adam Dale. And uh, he's taken that catch, and he's got one more over to bowl. He might yet be the hero for Queensland. Wow, so it's stuck, and I guess in the end, that's all that counts. And that's it for how...